Ms. Yeo Wan Ling. Mr. Chairman, our 270,000 SMEs in Singapore represent 99% of all companies in Singapore and are arguably the heart of our Singapore economy. In turn, our hardworking and loyal SME workers are the beating hearts of our SMEs. As the world adjusts to the new landscape that COVID-19 has brought about, SMEs and our SME workers more than ever need to pivot, upgrade and keep relevant with the changes to keep afloat and to come out of COVID-19 stronger and better. At the heart of the pivot, the unions believe that two things must happen. Number one, the uplifting and upgrading of our workers to be a dynamic and adaptive workforce to drive the much needed pivot that many SMEs need now. And number two, the building of an even stronger Singapore core that will allow our SMEs to weather this and other future economic storms. Collison, or better known by their pearly white line, is a progressive SME in the labour movement family. More than 88%, 88% of Collison's workforce are Singaporean, and employees above 40 years old are sent on training to acquire new skills at least once every three years. As part of preparing for the new economy, Collison staff attends courses in Google AdWords analytics training to enable them to receive competitive wages and grow to be even more future-proof. Collison has weathered the COVID-19 well and continues to grow market share both here in Singapore and overseas. They have built a strong Singapore core through redesigning jobs, upgrading work processes and upskilling their workers. SMEs like Collison, must not be an exception. What will the Minister of Manpower do to assist SMEs in job redesigning and to uplift our workers so that they remain relevant and an important pillar for SMEs to be able to pivot? Secondly, keeping in mind that many SMEs depend on foreign workers as part of balancing out their limited resources, with the narrowing of the uh, dependency racial ceiling and SMEs' concern about the viability of their businesses, how does the minister plan to assist and support SMEs to create a more balanced Singapore core? 